Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks. And a friend of mine sent me this file, and he, we've been working with messaging, and it, it, the, the paddle would take three minutes to cut out through cardboard. So there, he got this from a DXF file, and the person I'm doing it for, first of all, I changed my, you had your nudge distance set on 0.25 and 0.25. I changed it to zero for right now. I'm going to change my nudge factor to 7 inches, and I'm going to select your item. I'm going to go up to a range, and I'm going to ungroup. So we need to go up here and select it all, go to range. And there's a problem right here. Break the 120 objects apart. So I don't know how many objects are in here, but that's another problem on another scenario. I'm going to grab just this, what is showing as a black hairline, and I'm going to nudge it out of the way. I'm going to take my smart fill tool. I'm going to specify it on black. And for right now, I could put a hairline, but I'm not going to. And if, since I don't know that there's a leak in here, I'm going to take my rectangle box so it won't take so long if it leaks out. And I'm going to click back on my item. And sometimes you have to, this is a good little trick to select that inner box. Then I'm going to take my Smart Fill tool, and I'm going to fill that box in. And it took a little bit longer than it normally would, so that might be the problem. Now I'm going to nudge it to the left a couple of times, and I'm going to go left click, right click, and now you have a red hairline that should cut better than that one by far. And now I can nudge it right back over, and that should cut. Now, he's got some other problems that I haven't even looked at yet, but this should work in just a word of, uh, it's always better to have your hairlines red. Uh, to me, that's a cut line, and it doesn't really matter to your laser as long as it's a hairline, it should cut either one. Now, he's got some other problems, and I'll, I'll look at that and see what's going on there. But that's the way I would fix that outer box, and you can see it's a lot cleaner and let's just do a little test here. Let's get it out of the way and let's color fill it now. And it did it a lot faster. So that kind of proves to me that there was something wrong. So if you use your duplicate distance, you can go right back. And that's why, well, that's just the nudge factor. But your duplicate distance, if we made a duplicate, you want it to set on zero, zero so you can get it right back. So I hope that helped them a little bit. And thank you for watching, and I'll try to figure out the other ones.